Hi friends, welcome to our channel. In this session, we will discuss design of Turing machine for addition function using unary number system. What do you mean by unary number? Unary number in the sense, a number is represented by using all ones or by using all zeros like this in the binary representation a number is represented by using combination of zeros and ones that is called binary unary means only ones or only zeros for example consider a number two two is represented as two ones for our convenience we are using a number is represented by using ones three three is represented by using three ones now the question is addition function so what is the 2 plus 3 is equal to 5 that means 1 1 plus 1 1 1 is equal to 5 once this is the output of the program we have to construct a turing machine such that it performs the addition in this format the procedure is very very simple this is the addition function. Traverse the entire string whenever plus occurred. That plus is replaced with one. Now, how many number of ones we have? We have total of six ones. But how many ones we required? We required only five. Simply the plus symbol is replaced with one. And the last one is replaced with the blank symbol. So the procedure is very, very simple. We have many ways to implement this one. But this is the very, very simplest approach. See this one step by step. I will explain. Initially, I am at state Q0. See this one. This is your example. On state Q0 with input 1, what I am doing? 1 is replaced with 1. 1 is replaced with 1 and then move to the right side. Suppose I am moving into this direction. Suppose right now I am at state Q1. On state Q1, if any number of ones occurred, all the ones are replaced with ones and then move to the right direction. That is this one is replaced with one. Actually, you can reduce the number of states also, but our convenient, I will explain in this fashion. One is replaced with one, Here again one, one is replaced with one. Here, any number of ones occurred before the plus symbol. All are replaced. So, at one particular point of time, we are at this position plus. Plus occurred. Plus is replaced with one and then R. Now, what is the output right now? One, one, one. I am at state Q2. At state Q2, right now, I am at this position. Here also, any number of ones occurred, one is replaced with one and then move to the right direction. So now at this position, now at this position, initially all the tape is an infinite, we can any number of blanks. Right now, I am at this position. You got it? When Whenever plus occurred, plus is replaced with one and then any number of ones occurred, all the ones are replaced with again one until the blank symbol occurred. Now what to do? Whenever the blank symbol occurred, that blank is replaced with the blank and then move to the left direction. Now the cursor is at this position, right? That is at state Q3. Now I am at this position. What is your aim? This plus is converted into one. Obviously, the last one is converted into blank. So this one is converted into blank and then move. That means this is happened. This one is converted into happen Q4. On Q4, what happens if any number of blanks occur? That blank is replaced with blank and then move to the right direction. This is the halt state. Observe, even though we are you are not writing this one, no problem. From this, the entire Turing mission is completed. The concept is the very, very simple. Whenever the plus occurred, plus is replaced with one this is the main important point and the last one is replaced with the blank this is the main important point this is the way to construct addition function for unary number system in the next session we will discuss subtraction okay thank you